If you're looking for a fun, compact convertible that seats four, your shopping list is pretty short. There's the Volkswagen Eos, and there's this, the 2016 Mini Cooper Convertible. Today we're looking at the 2016 Mini Cooper S Convertible. As you see it here, it comes loaded with parking sensors, navigation, leather interior, and a turbo motor connected to a six-speed manual transmission for about $36,000. Though Mini is clearly a BMW brand these days, the cars have final assembly in Oxford, England, and they retain many of the styling cues that originated with the original Austin Mini from back in the day. Let's start with the engine. Under that British bonnet is a 2-liter twin-power turbocharged 4-cylinder engine. It puts out 189 horsepower and 207 pound-feet of torque through the front wheels. In a car of this size, that is plenty of power. Economy is rated at 34 miles to the gallon highway, 25 around town. The boot is interesting. It opens revealing a small space to put a suitcase. However, it also has levers to lift the canvas top to help fit in larger items. Need more space? The second row even folds down. Speaking of the roof, lowering it is an easy two-step process. First, you can simply open it to function as a sunroof or you can go all the way for a full top-down experience. It's quick and easy with near silent electric motors humming away for less than 20 seconds for the complete operation. The driver's space is very unique with loads of mini specific design features. When shopping for a mini, you can select no less than eight different seat designs. These here are the basic leather and are quite comfortable. Where the original Mini had a massive speedometer right in the middle, it's now home to a large multi-function infotainment display. This shows navigation as well as parking assist radars when the car is equipped with them. Media player integration allows for playing music off of an iPhone or Android device with a USB interface. Switch the car into reverse gear and it shows a backup camera. The Speedo has been moved from the center console to the steering column where it belongs it also includes a small graphic display with multifunction information. Even with the six-speed manual transmission, drivers can select from several driving modes, including Eco or Sport. Though it's honestly hard to tell the difference, the car is pretty quick in any mode. Driving the Mini Cooper S convertible around town is a delightful experience. It's got a lot of pep in any gear, and flinging it through the corners is a blast. Since this is a convertible, the chassis isn't as rigid as the full coupe if you really push it. But this complaint is minor since it's really the nature of any convertible. If you want race car stiffness, you'd do better with the Mini Cooper S coupe. The best thing about this mini convertible is you don't have to leave the family at home when you want to go out for a fun drive. We were able to pack two kids into the second row, and when the top went down, their eyes lit up, and the requests to buy the new mini convertible have been non-stop ever since. Compared to the Volkswagen Eos, this mini Cooper S convertible is simply at a different level. It's faster, more fun, and has miles of style to spare. To test drive the new Mini Cooper, visit your local AutoNation Mini dealer today. For the AutoNation new car test drive, I'm Ryan Douthit. Thanks for watching.